Hello people, how's everything going with you? So, well welcome back, welcome to the channel. Well, I hope you thanks first of all for the current 100 odd people who've viewed my last my last countryside ride um, ride out video. I appreciate it, that was very good. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell, like and comment this video, I appreciate it. This one is, which kind of like a last spare the moment to be honest, because like my mate, um, he's got um, a 3 series, his amplifier is broken, you know what, that, that, that uh, video was quite good, why don't you take your bike out to Sheffield where this thing is and um, ride it out, put your um, top box on it, go and pick it up from me, I'll pay you petrol and you can make, it, make a video, so I thought why not, so that's what I'm doing, I'm going, my top box is on it as you can see, my top box is on the thing and my sat nav's on there as well and I'm going to be riding to um, to Sheffield, collecting this, this amplifier for him, bringing it back and showing you a few of the country roads. I think it's, you probably know it. I think I'm going to go on the Woodhead Pass, which is basically from, which goes from Hyde to Sheffield. So that should be good, all the different Wangley roads I'm going to do. And it is supposed to rain, but not supposed to rain too much. So hope, fingers crossed it doesn't rain too much, but you know English weather is always crap. So anyway. Let's get back to it and hope you enjoy this video and goodbye.
that was a good ride. Good ride. Sorry about my hair. Helmet hair. Um, well, I went down to, um, I did the uh, Wood Hyde to Woodhead Pass. Hyde to Sheffield, Woodhead Pass um, ride. As you can see, it's not that great. Um, I realise it's not the best place at all. It's good when there's no traffic, but that's very rare. Um, it was better coming back, but the clamp on my camera broke, so I couldn't put it on my head. So, but it was rubbish anyway. Um, I had to drive really, really crap because I got to Sheffield, and turned my car, my bike off. Sorry, got the part. I got off my mate. Put it, put it away. Turned my engine on. It was struggling. I was like, Jesus, it won't, it wouldn't, it just wouldn't start. The engine management light came on. It needs a service, basically. Now my bloody bike needs a service. So basically, I'm going to um, get my bike service, which is about two to three hundred quid, which is fair enough because it's, it's it's a motorbike. It needs a lot of things doing to it, so that's going to get serviced. Uh, but the light came on, so basically, it, it would have been a crap ride anyway coming back from um, coming back from Sheffield because I couldn't get past uh, sixty five mile an hour on my bike because it just wouldn't let me. It was like struggling because because the engine management light came back on, so it definitely needs a service. But um, I hope you like the actual um, the music I've put in the background, and I hope you like the um, the uh, the ride. I know it was very trafficy, and, and you know what's annoying with with why Woodhead Pass is shit. I found is that they they've put um, du solid du double solid solid lines in between on on throughout for for when it's unsafe to overtake. It isn't say on you, you can you know when you can when you can see half a mile or a mile down the road or yeah half a mile it's not on it's not it's not unsafe to overtake unless something's coming if it isn't and they put solid lines so you can't overtake and then the one where, where they don't put solid lines where you can overtake is on a corner and you can't see the when it bend which is stupid so well done Woodhead Pass whoever bloody um invented that you stupid freaks whoever sorted those road markings out change them because it's a good place to ride but your markings are stupid unless we break the law which i'm not going to because um my bike will be going into for service first i first i got a thing of my um uh, the problem of my of my um flat tire on my bike and now i've got a service problem so it's gonna have to go to bmw it's gonna have to be um Service at BMW, full on service with two, three hundred quid, I reckon. Get it plugged in, get it cleared, and that'll be another video to show you the process of how good it feels afterwards. And um, yeah, that's about it, really. Um, I hope I know I waffle on a lot. I hope um, you like this my video and the video is itself. Um, as I said, don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell. Um, so anyway, um, thanks for watching and me waffling on, and I will. Got some more videos there and there. I'm gonna put up on this end screen. Um, I'll see you all soon and have a good time. Bye bye.